What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to edit the website fonts or typography using the Enzo WordPress theme. This is our Visual Moto free WordPress theme and in my personal opinion the best WordPress theme for free that you can have. So to install it I'm gonna leave a link in the description below in a card over here. But you can go to WordPress, Dashboard, Appearance, Themes, Add New and just type Enzo. As soon as you install and activate it, you're gonna be able to see a lot of an away or a plenty of new options into your WordPress customizer option, the panel that you can customize your site under appearance. As soon as you click on it, you're gonna be able to see into the left of your screen a plenty of options, so you're gonna need to click on typography. Once I have not installed all of the plugins as recommended, the by clicking on the link to install plugins, I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tour where I explain how to install this plugin. It's free as well. I'm gonna see some parts of short codes into my site, but this is gonna be removed as soon as I activate the borderless WordPress plugin, that is the Visual Moto free WordPress plugin. But let's go to this page, the About Us page, and go to the typography under Customizer. And here we're gonna be starting our addition into the body of the page. The body is every part of the page where we use the paragraph tag, the P tag. So these two, these two texts that I have selected are examples of body. First of all, let me change the font family. I'm gonna use my favorite one, this is, that is Oswald, but you can choose from all of the hundreds of Google fonts. If you need to upload a custom font, I recommend that you follow a video tutorial that we have on the Visual Modo WordPress channel on their YouTube. After choosing the font family, you can go to the font variant. The font variant is, is when you can make it stronger or bolder. I'm gonna search for regular, but you can see that it has more options. After this, we have the font size. To make the font size works, make sure that you type PX. So, pixels. Here is example of the body fonts edited to a bigger size. If you want to be regular, just not type anything on that field. Now, the text transition. And the text decoration. We can underline, overline, make it italic or bold, for example. Now, the line H, that is the H of the text line into the body of your page. Once again, you need to type the PX. For RDPX, for example, here is the result. And we have the letter spacing, the margin top and the margin bottom. And we can do the same or almost the same for every single part of the site. The headings, the headings number, the menus, the submenus, the page titles and the page subtitles. We can choose a different font for the section, we can choose a different size, we can choose the text transform, for example, uppercase or lowercase. Everything simple, fast, easy and effective. So we can customize your site. After the edition is made and finished, it, you can click on publish and we are good to go. And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And I see you later. All the best.